guy that's supposed to put the air conditioner on is supposed to be here today. Um, but before he gets here, I'm just going to show you what I've done. Notice I'm not bending over and dodging the plant. I cut it all down today so that I could get through there. Then I'll get someone to move that plant right there, that potted plant, so I can use the gate. Anyway, that's the plan. Oh, it's bright out here. So, um, let's see. I'll show you what I've done. Just in case um, that guy has to... Oh, no. Oh. Oh, well, anyway. Um, just in case the air conditioner guy has to drop the, the, my camper down because it's a pop-up um, to get up on the roof to put the air conditioner on, um, I kind of cleaned everything out, put things away. It needed it. It was getting really congested in here. Um, so I'll give you a quick look through. And of course you've seen this back here. I did finally get all the the new wallpaper up all the way around which I'm really happy about I've got to cover this which is the balance for up across there there's no balances for that or that I'm, I don't think there's one in the bathroom but anyway I, um, I'll cover that like I did the one over there on the jackknife edge Put the wallpaper on the door, and then I'll be done with the wallpaper stuff. So the kitchen counter is all cleaned off. Like I said, just in case he has to drop this down to put the air conditioner on. And so the things I'll have to take down when I close it all the time is going to be that coffee pot stand right there. And then I'll have to take this little guy down. It's just a decoration that's there. And then I have to take my chair out, and I'm hoping I'll just scoot it to the floor, and that this whole thing will just close down on top of it, and same with that table, but we'll see how that goes. And then, um, here in the bathroom again, I'm just going to put the curtains across. We'll see how that works. I may change my mind. I did keep those boards that were up there just in case, but we'll see. This air conditioner, um, I will probably put it up for sale. I don't need it in the house. And I've got nowhere else to put it, so I may as well just sell it. Um, let's see what else. My grandson's guitar. Um, mom, 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 mom. So yeah, I'll just have to move that table and this chair to close it down. And there's the, the balance across the back that I covered with the same wallpaper and I think that's all that I'll have to take down if he does need to close the um, high-low up to get on the roof I'm still not used to saying high-low I always want to say trail manor anywho so that's what's happening I'm super excited to get an air conditioner up there um, he's bringing two units um, so I can decide which one I want, which one's going to work better for this size RV, blah, 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 blah. So yeah, I'm excited. He's supposed to be here any minute. That's why I keep looking out the window. Is he here? Is he here? Okay, so the guy showed up. His name is Alex, I think. And I didn't realize it, but he's from Madera, and it's a mobile RV repair place. There's their phone number really really nice guy when he started talking to him I was like where are you from and uh, he's originally from um, Armenia he said so anyway he's checking things out and I'll let you know
Gary's working on getting the inside set up. So I'll try and get in there and get some pictures or video. Yay, I'm so excited. It's a Dometic. I don't know the name of it, though. All it says is Dometic on the outside. We'll see.